India's Prime Minister Narendra Modi stated that India is committed to protecting the freedom of navigation and combating piracy and terrorism in the Indian Ocean region. Now on Monday, Bulgarian President Ramen Radev expressed his gratitude from the Indian Navy after they seized a ship from Somali pirates. President Radev stated seven Bulgarians were among the crew members rescued by the Indian Navy. Now, over the weekend, the Indian Navy said it had taken control of a hijacked bulk carrier and evacuated 17 crew members. The Indian Navy stated all 35 pirates on board, Maltese flagged MV Ruin, had surrendered. And the vessel was checked for illegal arms, ammunition and contraband. The whole operation took about 40 hours and involved drones, Navy vessels and Marine commandos. Men on the bulk carrier fired at an Indian warship in international waters on Friday, triggering the Navy to intercept the vessel some 2,600 kilometers off the Indian coast. Now, the vessel was first boarded by pirates on December 14th near the Yemeni island of Socotra, around 240 kilometers off Somalia. Activity from Somali pirates has dropped in recent years. However, there has been growing concern it could resume amid the political uncertainty and wider chaos in the region that has included attacks on ships by Houthis. India is flexing its naval power in international waters. Recent measures include anti-piracy patrols and deployments close to the Red Sea to help protect ships from attacks during Israel's war with Hamas. The Indian Navy has helped at least four merchant vessels that were attacked in high seas by the Houthi forces. Indian forces include three guided missile destroyers and reconnaissance air force. For all the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.